Hello folks, this is JeffreyJ329 here about to play my 74th gameplay of the Pokemon trading card game online for the PC. I'm going to feature a deck that was in Japan's top 16, and it features my all-time favorite Pokemon. It's Meganium from the new Lost Thunder set. Let's feature right here. I'm going to try a deck with and then I'm going to feature a match with it. So here is Meganium, right over here. Let me get to it. There we go. So Meganium has a stage ability. Right here is 150 HP stage 2. It has a ability called Crip Wagon Herb. Once there is a turn before you attack, you may use this ability. Choose one of your basic Pokemon to play. If you have a stage 2 card of your, uh, in your hand that evolves from that Pokemon, put that card into the basic Pokemon to evolve it. You can use this ability during your first turn to a, on a Pokemon that was put into play this turn. So it's a pretty good ability, so you get an interesting stage 2 doubt. This deck plays 4 stage 2s. I'm going to feature all of them. So pretty much, you get, your main games are main stage 1 to get out, stage 2 to get out first, and then you pre ball to the other stage 2s. So I'm gonna show you how the deck is. The, all of them, the, all of the deck is. So play the one more line of slacking. That's the first stage one. It has a ability called Lazy. It's 160 HP stage two. As long as it's Pokemon, it's active Pokemon, your opponent can play. Have no abilities except for Lazy. So you can promote them to the active spot. We can strike that like heavy abilities like like Malamar, Zork, like Rock. Uh, lost much with the floor pack, the Sky ability, and uh, like Nagandero is charging up. A lot of abilities you can shut down with this Pokemon here. We also play a. Uh, 2 2 1 line, the new uh, uh, level 9 tails GX from the set. As the ability uh, Mysterious Guidance, 20 HP stage 1. When you play this Pokemon from your hand to evolve one of your Pokemon during your turn, you may search your deck for the, up to two item cards, reveal them, and put them to your hand. Then shuffle your deck. So you can be able to like Red Candy, Time of Ball, Look of Whistle, or Ultra Ball, or any other items you can like Switch. Another example, Choice Band to get those, uh, help you win the matchup. The next place is the 2 2 line of Grenada GX, this is our main attacker of the deck. It has 2830 HP stage 2. It has the ability called Shuriken Flurry. When you play this Pokemon from your hand to evolve one of your Pokemon during your turn, you may put three damage counters on one of your opponent's Pokemon. So you can use it to fix numbers. You can hit like uh, weak Pokemon out as well. If you get two of them, you can hit up to six. So you can pretty much one shot any like Lost March or any like 60 HP Pokemon as well. This tag has uh, for one water. For one of the double colors is H last for one tag, which is a main attack. You may shuffle this Pokemon and all cards attached to your deck. So we're gonna shuffle them back in, and then we keep attack using the loop. You gotta make games and slack uh, uh, good news GX out, keep attacking with it. And get shown back in the deck, so we'll never deck out. They also play the 3 3 line of Swampert. It's 160 HP, stage 2. Water type has a ability called Power Draw. Once during your turn before you attack, you may score a card from your hand. If you do, draw 3 cards. So pretty much just that's a draw engine for this deck. You don't play as many supporters in the deck. So you draw, try to get the draw cards you need, but it's got cards you don't need. And it has attack 3 colors energy, Hydro Pump 80 damage, this has 20 more damage times the amount of water energy attached to this Pokemon. We're going to play 1 energy this deck, which is super boost energy, which counts as a basic energy, but if you have 3 or more stage 2 to play, it counts as 4 of any energy. So you can do 160, you can do 1 energy choice by the finish game zone, if you're not going to buzz wall, Lele, the Cosma, Ultra the Cosma, all those attackers right there. And also I forgot to mention Sly King's attack as well. Uh, 3 energy critical move, that's 160, discard energy from this Pokemon, you can attack during your next turn. There's another thing you can finish, you can just remove one Andy as well, to finish off games as well. Now we go to the trainers and supporters. For Acrobike, we're going to top two cards in the deck and put one of them to your hand, discard the other card. So if I just dig it through again, try to get your cards you're looking for, hoping to get a card you need, like a game or anything, any piece you need. It plays two, four Liquid Whistle, so you deck the two little cards named Looker, but you don't put them to your hand, that's over your deck. That's another way to thin your deck as well to get the cards you need, or you can get Looker. Looker's the part of, you draw three cards from the bottom of your deck instead of the top of your deck. They play uh, four Nest Ball to search your deck for basic Pokemon. Put it to the bench, shuffle to get our Chicken Readers, or Slack Kings, Slack Cars, Frokies, Mudkips, Bullpix, anything like that. One Power Pad, shuffle two cards, choose supporter cards if you discard power into your deck. So we have the supporters we need, like uh, Luca Whistle, Guzma, Lily, Gladion, anything like that. They play four Red Candy, which is the main juice of the deck. Choose one of your basic Pokemon in play if you had a stage two out of your hand that was from this Pokemon. Put that card into the basic Pokemon to evolve it. You can't use this card during your first turn or basic Pokemon that was put into play this turn. I like McGinn, you can put use it where you put it immediately put it, which is pretty awesome as well. Then we play two rescue sweatshirts to get them back to those Pokemon from the hand or to the shovel of two Pokemon to the deck. They play four uh, three switch to uh, get uh, if we get stuck or we can need to get that uh, a Pokemon attack it on. They play two time ball to get those energy, or we'll get those energy by so depending if each heads we flip on the coins. Get those evolution out as quickly as possible. I think we play three Ultra Ball, so you can start get those two, uh, search out any Pokemon on the deck. But it's going to cards. Play uh, one Brooklyn Hill to search for water or fighting. So the only thing we're searching is Froakie or Mudkip. 
All on the whole picks too. They play uh, two extra rollers, so if the opponent's heavily damaged, we can use, pick it up. So that's any, that's any damage counters, we put it, put it up put it to our hand. They play two Glanium, we look at our face down price cards and put one of them to your hand. Then shovel this Glanium into the remaining price and put them back face up down. If you play Glanium from the hand, it does nothing. So, um, you can like, like any that's prized, like if it's like, if you super boost energy is prized or any piece is prized, you will get it out with Gladion. Then you play two Goose, uh, two Goosema to sh get those no active knockouts to sh trap someone and get stuck or anything or get those key knockouts. Then you play one, uh, two Lily to draw to have six, good turn to draw first turn to have eight. It's good on your first turn right there. Then you play four Looker, draw three cards from the bottom of your deck, which is the support you don't see often at all. And it just feels a look of whistle as well. We play uh, two choice bags to do the dirty more damage for the e to hit numbers with those EX and GXs. And then we play the one energy, which is very interesting, the super boost energy like I explained earlier. So we pretty much attack with good energy EX. You just attack with good energy EX. You put it back to the deck. You, sh you draw the big pieces out again. And then just keep attacking over and over. So the deck, I hope you guys enjoyed the description. Let's see if we get a game with this deck. I hope we get a win with it. This deck takes a lot of skill to play. You have to really think a lot of with it. So hopefully I can win with my favorite Pokemon. I mean, it's my favorite Pokemon all the time. So hopefully it's my good luck charm. Let's see what we're going against today. We're going against David is we're playing a water, metal, colorist, psychic deck. So he calls a coin. We're going to go coin, so we're definitely going first. Probably going to play against a low nine tails, swamp plus a leo. Got to go with that. We draw a hand, we don't draw a basic. We draw six supporters though. Wow. Two lilies, two lookers, a glade on lily, glues my and a timer ball. You definitely want to start a little in Vulpix so you can beacon to get those two Pokemon that you need. You want to get at least two main game out so you can just keep looping up the attacks. Okay, oh, we start with like, okay, we're gonna start with Lolan Vulpix stuff. We take two more, which is fine. They want to see a first turn. We're gonna try to do a first turn a little bit. Drop Vulpix, we'll try we'll to check a as well. We're gonna next for for a Mudkip. So we got our draw engine going on here. And we're gonna go for that first turn, Lily. Oh, it's Metal Girl Stoker there. Okay, so we're gonna see we're gonna nest ball for the Mudkip. So let's see what's fine. Let's see if a super best energy is in the deck, of course. And it is, which is good. Alright, so let's see. Night Souls is there. Swamp is there. Good Ninjas are there. That's good. Uh, Focus is there. Yep. We'll go with Mudkip for now. We'll attach the choice band to the Lone Level Picks. And then we're gonna Lily for four. Five cards, I mean. That's what we got. Okay, we got two more on that spot, which is good. We're gonna get Froakie and we're gonna get another Chikorita out. So we gotta hopefully get an attack in the next turn. And then we're just gonna pass after that. It's a good start. I think a red candy hole. We'll try. We're gonna probably use the Lily, uh, the Luca next turn. Try to get the, we're gonna try to get the Ultra Ball, get the Nine Tails out. We'll search for like a red candy and a Timer Ball. But yeah, Solar Lair and Metal Girls look like more. Look, Look, it's uh, Solar Lair, uh, Metal Girls with nine tails. So, Metal Energy to the active. We'll see a Lily for four. Like the Cosmog. See another Beldum coming down. We're probably gonna We're gonna see a Beacon here, which is fine. They wanna look at The best option is to look at here. Yep, we're gonna see a beacon from the Vulpix. Probably grabbing a ninth tells probably like a Matango or Song or something like that. Which is okay, well, I'm okay with this. Let's see what we got with this beacon attack. Beacons are a free uh, attack. Our little bug says you grab a two point one attack. Oh, see a medical and a Song Leo. Okay, probably is not playing a uh, nine tells line. We draw a Glanium. We're gonna look at the draw at three. Acrobike my game of Froki. Okay, we'll drop the Froki down. We're gonna Acrobike. Uh, Swamper Looker. We're gonna take Looker. Yeah, we're gonna take Looker so we have a draw supporter for next turn. And then we're, uh, we're gonna Beacon for a Ninetales. And we're gonna grab Ninetales and a Meganium here. That's the plan. Next turn we can evolve to Ninetales, grab our Red Candies. So we can evolve to Meganiums. Mechanium to Meganium will um, quick ride out to the other Meganium and then we'll. Um, then we'll have the rest of the to the Swampert, we'll work into the Swampert as well. We'll, uh, we'll quick ride out into the uh, Swampert so we can get our draw engine going here. 
that's my candy. That's why. That's why I assume you grab Soul Glider and Metagross. Oh, oh there's the Nine Tails. So he's going to grab probably two red candy here. Good news, I don't think he can knock us out this time, which is great. So he's grabbing the two red candy. He's going to go up to Metagross and Soul Glider. It's going to be a tough matchup because we have to hit hard. We don't hit that hard. We got the two shot the Soul Glider or Metagrosses. Okay, so he lost to Soul Glider and Metagross. Lost to Matang. Time of ball. Gets two talent side, so no evolution Pokemon for him. And you know. Oh, Trubos is gonna switch out to Soga Leo. Oh, switch out to Metagross, actually. Probably gonna see an algorithm GX here. Oh, it's headed to the Soul Lair, actually. I'm probably gonna see a Soul Burst. Oh no, I'm gonna see Augur with that, actually, not Soul Burst. Geo Fest has to the act uh to the act of Metagross. And I'm probably gonna see an Augur with GX. Maybe a Soul Burst GX. I need an Ultra Boss, he can't uh Augur. He's gonna, uh, gonna see an Augur with him. He's probably gonna grab a couple of Metagross, he's probably gonna grab some more energy for Soul Leo. So you can have him attacking. Hopefully next turn. Oh, Slack and Slack would be great this matchup too. Cause we can they, they can't really ultra and they can't charge up with uh, Metagross. They should grab that instead of the other Fogger. Ah, they froaky. That's the other the algorithm. So that's what we get. We get a Swampert. Okay, so we don't have to register that Swampert. We're gonna go to Nine Tails. We're gonna grab Red Candy and Timer Ball. Hope our Timer Ball works here. So then we're gonna Red Candy into the Meganium. Then we're gonna quick, quick wipe the into the other Meganium. And then we're gonna quick wipe the into the Swampert. Okay, and then we're gonna power draw. I'll probably discard. Uh, I'll discard Gladion. And draw three. Okay, Red Candy, Acrobike, and. Uh, let's Acrobike first. Let's see what we got. Guzma, Luka. We're gonna take Guzma. We have a Luka right on the hand. I'm gonna time a ball now. Let's see what I got. Okay, I think I have one heads. I'm gonna go to Ninja with that. I can't really. Oh, I have a looker, so I haven't played a supporter yet. I'm gonna play looker first. Okay, I'm watching. I need to get my. Uh, I need to get my uh, super boost yet, just yet. I'm gonna also go ninja. I'm putting three on the active. And I'm going to just pass. For now. Next time I'm gonna uh, look a whistle, I'm going to power drill hover to get that super boost energy off and running. That's another matter goes coming down. Another red candy for another matter goes. He's so got three matter goes from play. Probably only has one. He doesn't have any energy to this card, which is great. Choice by into the Sogaleo. We can't Solbus now. He only can uh, Augur, uh, Geotech. He already uses his GX. He already uses uh, Augur with GX attack. So it's going to take a little while to sell away energy. So he's had his a while. Uh, I don't energy to the uh so Galeo is gonna max potion. Okay, we're still gonna see a knockout on the night house. So he's gonna uh sunstone strike. It's gonna field blow our choice bat, which is fine. Then that's more for a slot cough here. He's gonna howl to uh shovel hand to draw seven. So they can't really charge up. He doesn't have a soul Galeo. We'll be trapped in the active spot with no energies, which is good. I'm, I'm gonna try to get that slacking uh, into, into play. Joe Jackson is up to the active, and we're gonna see a Sun Steel Strike for the knockout. Then we're gonna see another good into GX here. Let's get good into GX out here. Let's see what we draw with this card. We draw, oh, we draw the Super Boost, great. So we're, uh, let's go for the Slack Hoth. 
try to get the Slack King into play. I'm gonna power draw. Uh, actually, I'm gonna. Uh, I can quick my when it hurt. But actually, uh, yeah, let me quick my. Oh no, I'm gonna save that quick man. I'm gonna power draw first. I'm gonna discard the Gladion because I don't need it. Okay, there's the Slack King. So we're gonna quick my into the Slack King. I'm going to uh, quick right into the second one of the GX. I'm going to, yeah, I'm going to put three on the active. I'm definitely going to attach the super boost so we got the attack going on here. And uh, we can't really knock anything out here. So I'm going to. I'm going to just hit slash from 110. I'm going to shuffle back to my deck. So I have to. I'm going to set off slacking. So his has no abilities whatsoever. So he has to Guzman his way out of it. No abilities whatsoever. Unless he draws Guzman. He has to Guzman his way out of it. Okay, he's got the Guzma. He's probably gonna be on the other Greninja. And this Greninja will be not uh, taking a knockout, I think. Just fine, because I can draw into another Greninja with uh I can just dip my deck with Luka Whistle. I have I can I can rescue sure the Foki back, I can rescue sure the other two guys back to my deck. Tennis metal to the Metagos. See your ultra road here. He should have at least three items in the scope. He does. He's got Ultra Ball by discarding. Try to get another Metagos into play. His fourth Metagos into play. Let's get some Matang. Yep. Lost to the Matang. Shield transition to the active. Good is no maximum, so next time we can take the knockout, we draw our right cards. Okay. That's a knockout on the good ninja, which is fine. Uh, I'm gonna set off Slack King, actually. That's not a bad idea. Okay, so I'm gonna. I'm going to the rest of the circle, the fuck, the fuck, the pieces back. Oh, I drew a red candy, which is good. Shuffle three into the deck. So I'm going to shuffle Foki, Greninja, and I'm going to shuffle Swampert. So we're into, uh, we'll do a look at Whistle first. Try to thin down as much as we can. Get the look out. Okay, so I'm definitely going to drop the mark. Okay, I'm going to quick wipe the hood to the Swampert. So we get more draw power. I'm gonna power draw this card in the Lily because I don't need that anymore. Okay, the Supers. Now we need the Froki. I'm gonna tell them both to thin. So we guarantee our Froki. We got the heads, which is good. We have the Greninja. I'm going to power draw again the Scarlet Acerola because I don't need that. Okay. There's the Froki, which is great. Uh, let's quick ride into the Greninja. We're gonna put three on the Matang. Actually, no, three on the doesn't seem bad either. Because we could lose my own knock it out. Attach the boost to the Greninja. Switch into Greninja GX. And then we're going to Hay Slash for the knockout. And we're definitely gonna shovel back into the deck, of course, because we need to. Try to take out two prizes. I'm gonna start off slacking again. So we got Chikorita and the Red Candy. He's got to charge up very slowly with this. Okay, so that's Slack King. If I can, go, if I can draw my choice ban, plus to another Metagross. Stretches the metal engine to the Metagross. Rescue stretches by the, uh, the Cosmos all the way back to his deck. I think, my, I think my second choice ban is prized, I think. I don't I only play two in the deck. Which is fine because I can just uh I'll take my turns easily. I can just right now Guzma up the uh throat. I can Guzma up the uh oh, Lele drops. Oh Lele has no ability. That's another knock I'll tell you I can take. With uh It's gonna sit the for six. And passes. My turn. Draw Issa Roller. So I'm going to uh power draw first. Just going to the low because I don't need that anymore. 
Okay, that's the focus. I need my second piece, which is Greninja. I'm gonna power draw again, discarding the uh, Chikorita. Actually, let's go to my second Swamper. I don't need that. Okay, got the Greninja, but I need my Super Boost. I'm gonna Aqua Bike too, so I can hopefully draw into it. I'll put three on the Nine Tails. I'm gonna goose my that up, and oh, I can't goose my that up. I need my uh, Super Boost this turn. Aqua Bike. Look a whistle or stretcher. I'll grab the look a whistle. Let's see, let me see. What's in my deck left? Okay, I need to draw. I need to draw that uh, that energy now. And I did, which is good. So we're going to do that. I'm going to switch. Uh, should I switch or should I? Oh, I already look. So I have to switch. I'll switch into Great Ninja, and I will hate slash for one ten. I'm gonna set off slacking again. Okay, we should be in good shape. Next time I can uh, get a good energy play, I'm gonna goose up the nine tails. So I can knock that out. Test throw energy to the Metagross. Oh, uh, max potions, the nine tails. Okay. Oh, max potions, the Metagross. Okay, that's fine. And it's gonna goose up the part of the Meganium. Oh, that's one. Okay, that's fine. He doesn't knock that out, so I can just goose my back. He's only doing 150. So he's just into the active. I'll probably see a guy for 150. I'll goose myself, so I can just goose my way out of this. Let me drop all this Foki. That's Greninja. Not my cup. We gotta drop Foki. We got a quick ride into Greninja. Yes, I'm gonna put three on the nine tails. I'm gonna goose off that, nine, that same nine tails. I'm gonna power draw as well, get rid of a candy because I don't need that anymore. Get that super boost. So now I'm gonna guarantee draw. I'm gonna haste slash for this for the knockout. Yes, I'm definitely gonna shuffle because I have to. Or else I'll deck out and lose. Okay, so we'll take two more prizes. We take the Ultra Ball, or we take the Switch. Okay, Switch is not bad. I'm going to set up Slack King one more time. Okay, so my next turn is to... My next, my next target is to go for that... Top of Lele on the bench there. And win, hopefully win the game. Says our car, drops a Cosmo to his bench. Plays Cynthia again. Grizzly can't really one-shot the Slack King because he's only doing 150. The Slack is 160. It's added to Metagross, and he's gonna get it out for 150, which is fine. So, okay, so that's what we draw. We draw the Super Boost, which is great. I don't have the power draw for it. Drop the Foki. I'm going to make uh, Megani of the Green Ninja again. I'm actually gonna Ace of all that Slack King. That Slack King. So does he get knocked out this time? I'll take three. I'll put three in the Lele this time. It's a roll, the slack, uh, the slack king, so I won't get knocked out. I'll send a Greninja. I will attach the super boost. I will drop the slack cloth again. I'm gonna quick grab her into the slack king again. And then we're gonna see a uh, haste, uh, and we're gonna just haste slash for 110. So don't, mm, yep, now that's see scoops. He knows the strategy. So there you go, folks. This is the deck of action. Hope you enjoy. Stay tuned for more videos. Back for now.